On tonight's news, man makes box for porthole window. Over to Jeremy for the weather. Jeremy. <laughs> the whole weekend is going to be a big one. We're going to be routering the rest of the wall panels. Then once we've routered or routered them, we're going to have to cut out all the recesses and holes. So the holes for the, the wall done one for one window, but we've got another three windows to cut out. And we'll have to cut the recesses for the, the, the bed. The bed has to recess into the cavity of the wall so we can get maximise the length of the bed. I'm six, six one on a good day. Um, the van from one end of the wall to the other end of the wall would probably be six foot, so you really want to try and get as much of that as possible. I sleep with my knees bent anyway, so like having the bed from wall to wall isn't going to be a bad thing for us, and it maximise the, the floor space that we have once we've finally got the, the living interior done as well. So again, to pull back and say what we're doing today, is we're going to be rooting the walls, cutting them out, painting them, then I'm going to do the floor, we're going to put a linoleum or vinyl, um, what's it? Vinyl floor? Yeah, yeah. A vinyl floor on to the ply floor that we have just now. We'll um, use the carpet adhesive to spray that on and stick it down fast and that should hopefully create some sort of water membrane or water barrier between the, the, the finished floor and then the, the, the sub floor so nothing can get through and rot the wood underneath it. Uh, and then after that, this is a bit ambitious for this weekend, we're going to try and finally finish the, the roof, the ceiling as well. We've got the ceiling 95, 96.5% done. We just have to put the spotlights up, wire them, and then the side slats. We have to pile the holes out for access to the roof rack in case we ever need to take the roof rack off or add to the roof rack. And then we, we, we just screw up the, the slats and that should finish that tight. Uh, they only go on after the walls are put on. So the walls will be snug and then that slat will be tight to the wall. It'll look amazing.
Pretty good. Looks good, looks good. Now we do six.
Hey! <laughs> That's gonna be a window. This is gonna be a window frame. So, we've made a box for the window. We're boxed out the window frame for the porthole window. We're gonna just simply put this in here. And it should fit nice and snug. You should fit in here like this. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that feels fucking good. Just, just oh, push, and it spits, it spits. Oh. Oh. There's something primeval about that, man. That oh, for the soul right here. Oh. Look at that. That box fits. Now we're going to put the actual wall panel in. Now, if we've got our, our wacky scientist D minus math correct, the wall panel should measure up with this frame. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be fitting with this brush of the road. This panel, this wooden panel. <laughs> onto the wall and this hole here should fit up with the hole in there it should it will first time what do you think fingers crossed pray for us here we go Test, we didn't even like try it before. We actually just hit record and put in. Oh my god, that is amazing! Oh, I'm so happy. I've had such a long day. We've had such a long day. It's been like nine hours, ten hours, ten hours, and I felt like we were getting nothing done, just filling holes and putting some spotlights up. That's a, that's a wall up in the van, and it's gonna be there forever. Let's take a closer look. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's lush. Here, I'll take you off the tripod, boys and girls. And give you a little. Oh, come on. From the floor down, floor up. Um, all we'll be screwing these in um, you can see screw holes there screw holes there ugly I know but we'll screw this back in we'll, wood, we'll put wood filler in the, the screw holes we'll sand that down beautifully and then we'll paint over it once it's done and you will not see a single screw hole in that lovely panel or in that box and then we just open the porthole window yeah <laughs> those screws go in the window to keep it closed my god that is I'm so happy I'm so so happy I'm starting to take this off and look what we found behind the headliner there it is Artlist.io 